Hey everyone, welcome to group break number 406. Today we have a 2021-22 Upper Deck the Cup Mixer with 21-22 Allure, 21-22 Ice, and then 22-23 Allure, Stature, and SP Authentic. So a couple of years in the mix here. Gonna be a fun break. So three times on the names, three times on the teams. Who you line up with is who you get. Good luck everyone. Next week we will have hopefully OPG in a case break format, which will be kind of wild. I, might do a half case, might do a full case. We'll see how, I'll just kind of take a look and see how it is, but gonna be a fun value break. Obviously you're gonna want Chicago in that. So here we go. Three times, where is our good old friend Excel? Good luck everybody. Once, twice, and third time. David on top, Bree on the bottom. There we go. And teams three times. Uh, once, twice, third time. Tampa Bay on top, Winnipeg on the bottom. All right, David, you have the Tampa Bay Lightning, Brian with the Edmonton Oilers, Christopher with the Chicago Blackhawks, Chris with the Leafs, Denise with the Canucks and Sharks, Patty with the Avs, Roshan with the uh, Stars, Denise with the Wild and Red Wings, Jean-Francois with the Kraken, Roshan with the Hurricanes and Blue Jackets, Raymond with the Penguins, Fotis with the Kings, Harvier with the Blues, Jean-Francois with the Coyotes, Dan with the Vegas Golden Knights, uh, Robert with the Flyers, um, we have Nicholas with the Rangers, Aaron with the Islanders, Kale with the Habs, Patty, you have the Flames, John with the Sabres, Eric with the Predators, Roshan with the Capitals, uh, Ryan with the Bruins, John with the Senators, Nick with the Ducks, Eric with the Devils, Nick with the Panthers, and Bree with the Jets. There are your teams. Get them into the team viewer here. Panthers, uh, Ducks, and Rangers, all good, Canucks, Sharks, this looks all good. Alrighty, team view is up. And here we go. So I think we'll start with ice just cause I think that is going to be the kind of lowest end product here. Um, and then we'll go, yeah, 22, 23 allure, 21, 22 allure, uh, stature, SP authentic, cup, kind of going from like, I guess we could do allure first because ice is like, you technically have your biggest hits there, but I don't know, on average, I feel like you might get a bigger hit out of allure. And the, yeah, that's a tough call. Um, let's do 22, 23 allure first, then, no, we'll do ice first. It's more packs. That's my deciding factor. Our sleeves here. We are almost out. And we're going to need 180 points as well, I think. 180 points, and do we have standards? Uh, yes. Might need more standards, of course. All right. Let's. 
after I get these top loaders ready, get into the brief. Alright, let's start with ice. Kick things off. On the ice note, all right, let's go ahead and let's set up a custom focus here. I believe we're gonna want it to be about 58 should be good. There we go. All right, here we go. Box number one, which was five, serial number on the back. Here we go. Good luck, everybody. Hopefully we get something nice out of ice. I can't remember if this is the same case as the Gretzky Auto. I don't, for some reason I don't think so. Because I think that was like a full half, I mean, technically it might've been the same master, but um, you know. All right, so there's all those, and then we should have the bonus pack in here as well. There it is. Um, we'll open that up first. Oh, there's your serial number again. Let's, yeah, these are great for sorting. That's a thick card at the bottom, but it's probably just a decoy. Let's start off with the, uh, you know what it's gonna be, but it could be something good pack. That guy's decent on the back. All right, we'll go off the back. Velarde Green for the Kings. Technically, no, it's not a rookie. The, oh no, it would be, yeah, it would be a rookie, right? Yeah. And Pagansky for the Blues. Not who you want to see. We'll uh, we'll ship all the base from it just because it's a little bit rare, technically. So Pagansky for the Blues. We'll just ship the base from the bonus pack just because it's harder to get. So, but the regular rest of the regular base will not ship. All right. Uh, Colton on the green for the Bolts. Sub-Zero of Barzell for the Islanders and rookie of Bernard Docker for the Senators. Pack two. Got one of those ice crystals in here. Uh, Byfield on the green rookie for the Kings. Swayman on the rookie ice crystals for the Bruins and Zahorna for the Penguins. On the rookie. This year for the Devils, ice premieres to $7.99 of Anton Lundell for the Panthers and a base rookie of Caulfield for the Habs. I'll, I'll make a separate pile just for the um, stuff that's potentially a little bit rare. There we go. Next pack. I do wish they would go back to like less parallels of the top inserts. Lee for the Islanders, uh, Pew Suter for the Red Wings, and Mercer for the Devils. Cause you know, it kind of it's kind of taking away the value of what the uh, true Ice Ninety Nine rookie is. So I think we have a frozen in time here. So Perunovic, Spencer Knight, and Frozen in Time of Cole Sillinger for the Columbus Blue Jackets. So this will get shipped to the Blue Jackets. Um, who had them? Roshan. Uh, if you feel bold, you can rip it open and get a mini inside of it. But if you're not feeling bold, then uh, you don't have to. <laughs> but they're always kind of fun to open up, so never know what you're going to get. You can get numbered ones, so if you do get a numbered good one, it's better. Uh, Braden Point for the Lightning, Saros on the purple, and Akin for the Bruins. We got here we have Line for the Blue Jackets and Lucas Raymond to 399 on their second ice premieres, red. And Valeno for the Red Wings. See, like I just missed the days of pulling a 
like you know your ice rookie if you get one is gonna be like a true rookie technically they're not even a true rookie anymore but um yeah kind of wild leon dry saddle for the oilers and coland on an actual true rookie 2999 but yeah i miss when there's just these and not all the parallels drysdale for the ducks got a jersey card here i think neighbors for the blues lindholm for the flames and Yan Yannick for the Yotes on the Ice Premier's jersey. Zegers for the Ducks on the green. Tage on the Ice Crystals. And Bear Boulet for the Lightning. Tage is for the Sabres. Two packs to go here. So probably not going to get an autograph. Got a jersey card, got an extra ice premieres typically compared to what you normally get. Pilon for the Capitals. Darlene for the Sabres and Pavelski for the Stars. But you never know. Oh, we do have a thick card here. So it could just be a base exquisite. We hope that it's got like patch auto, but we'll find out. Denisenko for the Panthers. Uh, Spezza for the Leafs. Ice Crystals of... Adam Fox and Philip Kurashev on the exquisite rookie for Chicago. Is that technically 2020-21? Yes. Uh, worth noting before I put it in the sleeve, a little indent there. I don't know if I'm going to get the light to show it, but there you can kind of see there. You can kind of see it. So. But Kurashev to $2.99 for Chicago on the Exquisite Rookies. So, not the best box of ice, but could do worse. I've seen worse, so. All right, and make sure there's no true rookies in there. I don't see any. Nope. All right, let's do alert. Clear cut's supposed to be the week after, so we might do a might do a draft of that. Do hit hit draft style. That's what I like doing with clear cut at least. It's one of my favorite methods, so. Alright. Alert time. Here we go. Let's let's hope for something cool. It's been a while since we've opened up a lure. I forgot how foily these cards are. Base, base, black of Gensel for the Penguins. Uh, Byram on the color flow. That's red orange. Uh, game stills of Kachuk for the Senators. Veneers on the rookie for the Kraken. And then base and base. Didn't, we didn't open actually too much of a 22-23 alert, so. Hints for the stars. Grizzlick on the red, or sorry, orange-yellow. Runways of Kaliev for the Kings. And a rookie of Korzak for Vegas with two bases. Ooh, we got a green coming up here. Uh, rookie Red Rainbow, I think. Yep, Red Rainbow of Noah Cates for the Flyers. Uh, green Blue, these are pretty uh, pretty good, I'd say. A little bit rarer, at least. Uh, Philip Hollander for the Penguins. A little bit rarer to get. And, yep, Green Blue Color Flow. Uh, and then the Rainbow Auto of Caden Korzak for Vegas. With a Castle for the Senators on the Rookie. So we're hoping for a low numbered card now because our auto was, you could do worse, but you could also do better. That would have been like, you know, if we had different names in that pack, a good red rainbow rookie, a good color flow and a good auto could have been insane, but can't all be winners. Gensel on the red rainbow, Aho on the red orange and Ooh, uh, one of the Pulsar color flows. I believe these are to 
a hundred, the spectrum, sorry. Uh, there's a Tracy rookie for the Ducks back there, by the way. But to a hundred, Jack Quinn on the spectrum color flows. These look pretty cool. So the regular ones, again, just have the like regular foiling and then the spectrum kind of have that more like, I, I think Panini calls them pulsers, but very similar to that. So uh, rookie year for Jack Quinn too. So not too shabby. And these are really cool if you do manage to complete the full rainbow. Kind of our first like major recapable hit, I would say. Nothing insane so far, but hey, you never know. Uh, Jeannot for the Predators, Kirby Doc on the red orange color flow, and Quick on the, uh, I think it's a Blockers with a Dylan Holloway rookie. The Oilers and Seth Jones got to spare on the base cards. All right. A few more packs to go here. Lintel for the Flames. Uh, Kalachinuk for the Arizona Coyotes on the color flow. Connor Hellebuck on the blockers for the Jets. Chase Pearson on the rookies for the Red Wings. Panarin McCain on the base cards. The base does feel like a little bit nicer than previous years, but we got a blurple, blue purple coming up here. There's Garland. Norris on the die cut. I believe these are just the regular orange slice. So Norris on the orange slice, not numbered. Uh, Mark McLaughlin on the blue purple. These are the rarest ones to get. So Charlie Coyle on the ice dough and Fajimo on the rookie. I think the ice dough are like tougher to get, but I don't know what their sale, the secondary market value is like. We have a... Uh, Green blue pulse are coming up here. Red of Rupert Hints, orange, yellow of Carson Meyer for the Blue Jackets, and Nick Aberigi for the Leafs on the green blue number to 50 with a Jake Christensen rookie in behind. So this little is not horrible for a number. At least this box hasn't been bad for numbered cards. There's one to 50 for the Leafs, and they, they look pretty cool. If you do manage to complete them all, it'll look pretty fancy because ironically we only have like the ones we have to match up but like if you get that full rainbow you know especially in the like spectrum pulsar ones look pretty cool all right 22 23 allure is actually like kind of okay hopefully we get one of those glitter bombs uh, Marco Rossi on the black rainbow rookie, Vlasic on the yellow orange rainbow, and Quartz of Tage Thompson for the Sabres, Braden Schneider rookie for the uh, Rangers. The Quartzes are kind of case hit style cards. Um, there is a print, or no, I think that's an intentional. No, that's, I think, a scratch there. But not bad. I've, again, I've seen worse. 21-22. We could have hit some better names in the parallels, but overall it was solid. All right, that one. That one's good. I don't know if I actually got through that, but... Yeah. Let's see what Allure has in store for us. Uh, I think it was the third pack in. We'll do these two packs, but I'm pretty sure the third pack in is, has been the hit for the past couple of years. So. And then, yeah, everything kind of is upside down. All right, here we go. These are stuck together a little bit. Uh, all base, Black Rainbow of Burns, Bernard Docker on the green blue for the Senators and Rookie. Uh, green blue is, I forgot this year that they're actually just straight up numbered to 299. And then Rookie is Lindell for the Panthers. It's got a little bit of a soft corner on that guy.
Alrighty. That's a base there. Base, base, red rainbow of Josh Norris. These aren't numbered. Uh, Gustafson on the control room and Shane Pinto on the rookie for the Senators. Hey, that is three Senators. That is pretty cool. Full pack for the Senators. Uh, Pedersen, Panarin, these are a little bit, I hate when foil cards get stuck together. Uh, it's just the Hughes. All right. Gibson for the Ducks. Yeah, this edge is a little bit rough on this guy and the corner, the corners are actually not great on these. Uh, Vasilevsky for the Bolts and Lapierre for the Capitals. Love to see a gold treasures. We haven't pulled a gold treasure style card yet, so would be nice. You gotta add that to the, you know, break bucket list. Uh, Bear Boulet on the Red Rainbow Rookie. Unique on the uh, orange yellow. I'll put that there. And Samuelson on the base rookie for the Sabres. Base, base. You know it's an old set when there's Huberdo on the Panthers. Chicken on the Coyotes. Um, Zahorna for the Penguins on the red um, orange color flow with an iced out of Ehlers for the Jets and a Lashinsky for the Flyers. Yeah, I think the iced outs aren't as rare as what they used to be. So ooh, we got a die cut in here. Base, base, uh, that is not a base. Oh, that's a good, good orange die cut of Mr. McDavid for the Oilers with a Tara Vinen, uh, jersey numbers, numbered to 199, 68 of 199, inverse of that jersey number, and Yan Unique. I'll take a McDavid. McDavid special card is always nice. All right, so this next pack, should just be nothing, and then the final pack should be the um, autograph. All right. Base. 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 Yen Yannick on the Black Rainbow Rookie for the Oats. Quartz of Carey Price for the Habs. And Bernard Docker on the Rookie for the Senators. Second Quartz. They are, I think they were tougher to pull. I can't believe that the corners aren't as sharp as uh, you'd expect for this cardstock. This cardstock's normally pretty durable. There we go. All right. This should be our autograph. Probably a red rainbow if I'd have to guess, because those were extremely common. Oh, color flow rainbow of, uh, or red orange of Barzell for the Islanders. Red rainbow of Cam Talbot for the Minnesota Wild. And a Swayman rookie for the Bruins. So, eh, meh. Could have done better. Same thing, kind of applies here. Could have done better, could have done worse. But Cam Talbot is uh, probably a big reason why McClellan both had lots of early success, but also why he got fired. So very interesting dynamic there. All right. Uh, it is time for Stature. Let's hope that Stature or SD Authentic or the Cup has a big hit. It, one of these should, right? We're due. Feels like we're due. All right. No patch. Go 
one off the back. All right, Brett Hall for the Coyotes on the Dignified. Jewel Erickson Eck for the Wild. Raw Blake for the Kings. Declan Chisholm for the Jets on the Rookie. Yanni Gord to 55. I believe this is the alternate orange. A little bit of marking up top. This card is normally the card that we have. Yeah, there's a little bit of chipping at the top there, but it's pretty common. Uh, one of 75, Tom Wilson on the Splendid Skaters Red. I do like the color match here. Not a big fan of the player, but hey, he's an all-star. Bertuzzi for the Red Wings to 35 on the blue. And our autograph is Jake Sanderson. All right, you know what? Does he have the highest resale value? No. He is, however, one of the better players in this set. So I'd classify that as a win in my books. But yeah, a couple of like low numbered cards. Wilson's really nice. The color match red on red, super nice, but nothing, you know, nothing spectacular. We want something, want something big. It's all going to come down to the cup. I did that. Okay, cool. All right. SP authentic time. Give me a retro future watch uh, acetate of Quinn Hughes. Uh, Korzak on the SP Top Rookies, Spectrum FX of Kucherov, and Quinn for the Sabres on the pageantry. There's no red in that pack, which seemed kind of weird. Felt like they were normally one per. Oh no, they're, yeah, every second pack, I think. Uh, Veneers on the red, Future Watch for the Kraken. That's not at least horrible. Parsonen for the Predators and Owen Power on the Green Future Watch to 199 for the Sabres. You know what? Not the worst pack. Not the worst pack. Is it the best? Heck no. However, could have done a lot worse. I think Beneers will still be a little bit of a soft bottom left corner on that guy, but. I think Beneers will still be good. I think Power will still be good. All right. Wierenski for the Blue Jackets. Ooh, Future Watch Auto. Marchenko. Hey, that's not bad. Marchenko for the Blue Jackets. That's not bad. Nothing like super fancy, but probably still in the top. Probably in the top five for the rookie class still, or like top 10. True leaders of Ovechkin and pageantry red of power. I didn't miss the red, right? I feel like they were on per, but. I don't know. I don't think so. All right, next pack. Good future watch. We take good future watches here. Uh, Reichel on the red. We'll put that in the sleep pile. Top rookies of Benir and Cider on the pageantry. I still think Reichel's going to come back around. I like his game a lot. It's struggle in Chicago this year, so. Red of Zuccarello. Oop, we have a collaboration is blue of McKinnon and McCarr for the Avs and Tage Thompson. If I remember correctly, this has been a pretty quiet case. So uh, Riley Walsh on the red for the Devils. Power for the Sabres. And uh, Sandberg is our other future watch for the Jets. So you know what? Two current year future watches, even if Sandberg's not the best. We'll take those over retros. Um, 
you know, not, are they the biggest hits? No. Are they the best? No, but at least they're current year. So maybe we'll get an extra auto in here. That'd be nice. Be nice. Uh, Aho for the Hurricanes on the red, collabs between um, Matthews and Marner, Spectrum Effects of Berggren. And player that I quite like, just hasn't put it together quite yet. So definitely a player to keep your eye out for though. Red of Imama for the Yotes, collab for the Devils of Hughes and Bratt, and then Border Low for the Sharks. Red of Sutsa for the Senators, Kachekov for the Hurricanes, and Yossi for the Predators. And last pack. You know what? Solid box of SP Authentic. Good reds on the future watches. Um, good base future watch. Two current year future watches. The power out of 199 is also solid. So uh, Bergeron on the true leaders. And hey, third autograph. Is it the best? No. But hey. Third autograph, Cal Peterson for the Kings. So, and a dry sidle pageantry for the Oilers. That brings us to three autos in a box with be with a good future watch auto. Uh that's a that's a win. Gotta celebrate the small victory sometimes, and that's one of them. Alright, let's do this. Uh this there. Alright. Now it's time for the big. The big tin, though. Like, this is what the break's all about, right? So here we go. Last time, our best hit was the printing plate book. Uh, honestly, last tin was pretty weak. The printing plate, plate book was cool, but when your best hit's a Ryan Zingle printing plate book, you know, you want something cooler. All right. I have a decoy available here. Here we go. Good luck, everybody. in the back here. I right, give myself a bit of a paper cut there. Here we go. Alright, decoy in the bottom. Or not in the bottom but on the top so we can press down without Revealing too much. There we go. Empty, and then we'll just slide the one off the back here. I'll just put this back inside. Cool. Uh, all right, Mason McTavish for the Ducks to 249 on the uh, base. We'll go next to the decoy here. We'll go Marc-Andre Fleury for Chicago to 249. Rookie patch auto next. Ooh, nice, uh, nice patch. Roots Alignin for the Sabres to 249. Nice two-color patch. You get the... Uh, Definitely part of the Sabres logo, no mistaking that. Not the best player, but hey. It's still okay. All right. Mr. Suspension, uh, Brendan Gallagher. I mean, beautiful card, three color patch auto to 99 for the Habs. 
Really, really nice looking card. Just not the highest value player, but. There. 130s. Let me get the 180s back then. The ones that I know that are 180s. Right, we got two options. I'm gonna go with the middle one. On the back, um Hasek to 49 on the show. That gives us that gives us three base cards. It's kind of weird. And uh, Mike Gartner on the Alumni Auto 250 for the Capitals. So, um, yeah, that was felt really, really, really weak for a 10 of the cup. Um, that was three hits with three base cards. Um, Give me one second here. I think it only guarantees you. Yeah, so yeah. So it's still like technically within their spec, but yeah, not. <laughs> Unfortunately, a pretty substandard box of the cup. I mean, the Gartner's really cool. The Gallagher's a really nice looking card. The Hasek's a cool looking card, but just not what you'd hope for from a tin of the tin of the cup. So, um, all right. Well, SP Authentic I think was our best product today, which uh, I wouldn't have bet money on, but hey. Always good to be surprised. And the Merchenko is a pretty sick pull. And again, that's not to take away from how cool like the Gartner is. It is a really cool card. The Gallagher is a really cool card. Um, the Roots line is not the best player, but it's still a cool card. Um, and again, like the Hasek is cool, but. All right, recap time. Um, let's go through some of the cooler stuff that I guess we got. We got a Quartz of Price, uh, Orange Slice of McDavid, Quartz of Thompson. Uh, red of veneers, green to 199 of power from SP Authentic. We got two of the like spectrums from 2022-23 alert, Aborigi 250, Jack Quinn to 100. Um, in terms of more hit based stuff, we got a Yan Unique jersey, we got a Tom Wilson Splendid Skaters red to 75, a Yanni Gord to like 55 orange from stature, a Bertuzzi blue to 35. But um, Kurashev from Ice to 299, Frozen in Time of Cylinder for the Blue Jackets. Korzak and Talbot were autographs from the two boxes of Allure. Sandberg for the Jets. We had a three-auto box of uh, SP Authentic with Sandberg for the Jets and Peterson for the Kings. And Sanderson for the Senators on the autograph. Um, the cup, we'll go with our base cards first, which are Flurry and McTavish. Uh, we hit a white, the show to 50, which is, well, to 49. So cool looking card, but you know, we would like that to be another jersey card or something like that. At least something different. Um, our rookie patch auto is Root Uh Gallagher in a signature patch or signature materials to 99. Um, and I mean, take your pick between hit of the break. If you like modern cards, you'll probably like the Marchenko Future Watch auto. If you like vets and Hall of Famers, I mean, this is a really cool looking card for the Capitals. So yeah, let me know what card you like better. Uh, that is group break number 40406.